What's going on guys, Little pressure washing here. I got Sadie behind me, the wash pup. She's feeling better. Thank you for the prayers and thoughts, guys. You know, it means a lot. You guys are like family to me and we really appreciate each every one of you guys. Um, if you're new here, I would suggest and hope that you would like to subscribe so you never miss a video. Hit the notification bell and press the like. It goes a long way. You guys have been killing it. Thank you so much, guys. It's the simple ba-boom tap and it really helps the channel. Today, um, she just got to eat some chicken strips, so she's happy. Today, we're going to be tackling that big job. Um, I wouldn't say big, but it's kind of a different job. It's the storefronts with all the mortar on it. So let me show you what we bought. We bought a new pump sprayer so we don't cross-contaminate. We bought some sponges. We bought a glass and tile scraper with the blades for the window. And this is what we're going to hopefully use and work. It's a Sophemic Acid Crystals. You mix six ounces to a gallon if it's kind of medium to not that bad. If, it, if it's really bad, 12 ounces, um, of course, the hot water. So we're going to mix that and we're going to do a test spot. I always do a test spot to make sure we're not taking the paint off. Now, I've talked to the contractor and I've advised them they may have to paint after this because they should have got the mortar off in the first place. But since they didn't, uh, I told them I have a pressure washing wand, not a magic wand. So we're going to do our best to dissolve that mortar without taking any of that paint off. And those old wooden doors, it's, it's all the, it, you'll see it in a minute if you haven't seen it. Uh, if, you, if you haven't checked out all the videos, a couple videos back yesterday and the day before, we were there. So this is going to be our last and final uh, run over there. We're going to give it our best shot. So I'm going to get this mixed up. I'm going to do six ounces. I'm actually just going to go 12 ounces to a gallon. So we're just going to go heavy, okay? All right, guys, we're out here right now um, trying this chemical out. I got my mask on, got my gloves, protective gear. And uh, it looks like it's taking off a little bit, but let me show you right here. Do you see? See the bottom down there? How it's coming off a little bit? I got to get over there. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna use a sponge. I had it to pump up the sprayer. I've been pumping it up and spraying it. We're gonna use a sponge now, so let's see. All right, guys, look, let me get this mask out of my face real quick. Hold on one second. What's going on, guys? I am finally finished. Um, I'm not gonna do anything else tonight. I'm gonna get back to the house. It's getting late tomorrow. I got a jam packed day of uh, gas stations. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be super busy. I don't wanna be up till the sun comes up when I get to bed. So we're gonna get up around right, right before noon tomorrow and we're gonna be busy all day long and all night. But I want to show you right here. Look, check this out. Look at that, guys. Remember that had concrete all on it? Not no more. Not no more. Look, remember up there? Not no more. Let me turn around. Let me show you, okay? All right, guys. As you can see, we got it all up, man. We got it all up. Got it all up the sidewalk. Got it off the building, got it off of the top of the building, got it off the wood, got it off the doors. That's a hole right there, don't worry about that. But uh, yeah, got it up, come around here, got the sidewalks looking, well they are brand new, but we got all of it up here. Got the door. Man, I'm, I tell you what guys, um, this has been a challenge. Um, this is kind of way outside the scope of pressure washing, removing mortar from buildings. Uh, yeah, but uh, nonetheless, we did it guys. Perseverance, perseverance. Uh, it was more so of a challenge. Like I said, I didn't bid this right in the first place. I should have bid differently. I didn't know the scope of the work, but I learned a lesson. But I would rather learn the lesson and not get the money that I should have got than get the money and not learn the lesson because with the lesson, I'm gonna be able to 
10x and 50x and 100x this in the future when i do stuff like this you know for new construction i'll be able to know how to do it know the right chemicals to use and charge right so yeah it's a lesson learned I, i'm much sure they have the wisdom than the dollar you know so this right here so yeah all right guys i want to show you this to you it's done it's a wrap Make sure you hit that like button. I'm on my way to the house. It's like 3.15. We're going to get some, some breakfast, head to the house, get to bed, get up. We got a busy day. We got the busiest day yet. Tomorrow is going to be a jam-packed video. Make sure you tune in. People over profits. Let's go.